children. It's time to wake up for our trip. Finally found a girl tall enough for AJ. So put your arm around her. We're in our hotel in Oslo. Oh, teetering. in front of the cathedral, one of the older churches in Norway. The birds of Norway just welcome your mother. <laughs> We're just talking about birds. It's that guy right up there. Oh, <laughs> oh he's waiting for the next so picture. <laughs> The Royal Palace. Sometimes see this even if there was nothing inside. Kelly would love In this. Kyle. Oh, Kyle. and we're legally served beer. <laughs> Can you tell where we're at? We're in the Asker Hughes Fortress. Anyway. Found this wagon in the big boat the Queen had. They didn't even have roads in Norway then, so they think it might have just been for show. <laughs> Hans and Hans. <laughs> Left side is made with potatoes and the lumpa is made with wheat. We didn't have potatoes in left side. This is left side. We made it on the side. Oh, that's right. I'm backwards. This is actually left side. Did you get some left side? I did. It was awesome. The elusive stave church. The teachers were checking out the schoolhouse. Courtney and I are so confused. It's Vigeland Park. And it's not raining, so we're pretty happy. Hey, Jay. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> right there. My favorite part of Oslo was the the folk museum. What was cool about that? Um, I like seeing all the different buildings they had up there, traditional farms. And the best part was eating the fresh lefse. What was different? Uh, it's a little bit thicker than we make at home. We also don't make it over a fire. And there didn't have potatoes in it, so. <laughs> what did you like in Oslo? Were there any surprises? The bar down by the wharf. By the wharf. I did love down by the wharf. I love. I did like the 
What was that museum or the sculpture thing? Oh, Vigeland Park. Vigeland Park. Oh. I did love that, surprisingly. Because um, of all the naked the people, ships. huh? Oh, the Viking Ship Museum. Love. I like the, uh, cool. the old village, whatever that was. Oh, the Folk Museum? Yeah. The Folk Museum was good. Old the left was awesome. the bomb. Mm -hmm. We're at the Oslo Central train station and this is our train We're taking the flam. This is what first class looks like, huh? Yeah. got a nice view there, Jim. Yeah. I know. Holy buckets. That's a lot of water. That's the siren singing. It's trying to lure me into the mountains to my death. Falling for it. Tell us about the Flam Railroad here. <laughs> well, they were just the most scenic railroad so you can ever have. Sure. Sure. The waterfall, the steepness of the core, I mean, the waterfalls are there everywhere. Absolutely gorgeous. And then there's the whatever creatures. Oh, yeah, oh. the ladies. The Huldra. The Huldra. The Huldra. Oh, the ones Doug were. They almost got me. No, <laughs> almost got me. <laughs> it's one lady. She's just magical and goes zipping around place to place. She was amazing. She was after. Me. The Fredheim Hotel. Our lodging. Snob. Hey, 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 hey neighbor. <laughs> Here we are in Flam. There was a giant cruise ship docked here. But it left, so all the stores closed except a couple. We'll have dinner at the Viking Brewery. This is the brewery. Pretty cool building. Nobody thinks I should build something similar in Montana. Jr. <laughs> got one single sausage. <laughs> the weasel trying, gets I'm everything else. Over here. <laughs> <laughs> Scotty got what, Scotty? A flight of fish food and a flight of beer. How could you go wrong? Can't go wrong there. The burger guy that ordered ketchup and the bug got us thrown out of here. <laughs> and down on this end of the table, the light eaters are sharing a, some cheese that tasted like old car seats. And uh, whatever that is.
ready to leave. We're going on this little bitty boat, not that big one. What was your favorite part of Flam? Um, Scott and I took a twizzy up the up the uh, side of the fjord and went to the lookout, and I got to pee in the most scenic bathroom in the world. All right, what did you like in the Viking Village? I liked shooting the bow and arrow. Did you hit anything? Yep, first shot, hit the sack. Better than some people we could mention. <laughs> I'm not sure she was aiming for the sack. I was. She missed the bus. I was. <laughs> I was aiming for the sack. Yes, that was fun. I love the Viking Village, just being in that super narrow valley filled with waterfalls. It was. A, very dark and cold when we arrived because the sun was just on the tip of the mountain, but then it gradually expanded and took up the whole valley. We were in the sunshine on a perfect blue sky day. The fjords are over there, the Vikings are here. We're unleashing something very aggressive in Cheryl and Courtney with all the axe throwing and archery. They have been off. Off the leash <laughs> since then. Off the leash. Off the leash. <laughs> ready to exert some aggression. So I pity the fool who tangles with them. Or has to room with them. <laughs> Tell them about Viking Jesus. Oh, yes. And Cheryl and Courtney have not stopped talking about the Vi Viking Jesus um, who did the <laughs> archery lessons and the axe throwing lessons. And, would very gently guide Cheryl's arms into the right position. She did very kind eyes. Yes. Very kind eyes. Yes. Very kind. Hence Viking Jesus. Very calming, and he'd say like, "I think you sh next time try aiming, but very kind and gently, and and true. It would work better if you throw the axe and aim it." Here we are in Bergen, staying at the Bergen Bars Hotel. There used to be a bank. This is the city center, central square, so we're pretty well located. The harbor. Sir. Huh. just pulled in. Maybe that's our tour boat for the next three days. <laughs> it's even like leaning forward a little bit. You can see from the other The building inspectors from Cut Bay. <laughs> These are all a little crooked. Been here since the 1500s. It's 10 minutes to 12. It's 
still light enough that the street lights aren't really required. Touring Old Town Bergen. This is inside the fortress. Like every good church, it's got arrow slits. It does not like fish. Sam's eating smoked whale. I think it's good. Yeah, yeah. right? Yeah. That's really good. Yeah. Yeah. And when he's served as a steak, it's even better in my opinion it's tastier and it's more like me. a whale steak Here's those weird trees we saw from the other side. Oh, is this like Yeah. Well, lucky us, we did. What did you like in Bergen? Um, I liked the meat whale. That was pretty good. What did it Tried taste? in the fish market. What's it taste like? It tastes kind of like jerky, actually. Like thick jerky. And then... That was kind of cool, how went up the side of the mountain on the trail. That was my favorite. Yeah, cool, cool view. Yeah. <laughs> well, that helps. Yeah. Bergen. I liked the being lost. <coughs> Seeing the part of town no one else probably, not a lot of people see. No one would go there on purpose, so. <laughs> <laughs> we did lots of walking, but it was fun to see all the small alleyways and really cute old houses and no sure. Here we are in the, what is this lounge called? Heaven. Heaven. <laughs> Jared thinks this is called Heaven. <laughs> Probably can't see Heaven. real well, but we are sailing off into the setting sun. <laughs> What's been your favorite part on the trip so far, Doug? Oh, uh, this small one, right? Yeah, I love this. Being on the cruise ship or being on in front of the camera instead I'm of I'm supposed to be behind the camera. There's a reason for that. It's probably your face, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I have a voice for our face for radio. <laughs> those guns again. Oh yeah. It's 11 o'clock at night. These people are water skiing. That's what it announces. 
see that we're showing up in Trondheim. This is the bus to hell. I know it. Where are we going? Going to hell. Give it a chance. Be your guide today, showing you the beauty of the Trondheim area. We will be driving to the Museum of Stjerdal, where you will be able to see a bit of the history of uh, where your family may come from. But we have found out that your family farm does not exist anymore, so we cannot take you to the farm. <laughs> uh, we will take you to the church uh, where your family may have visited the service um, as often as possible. Unlikely. So, yeah. <laughs> you know, we're pouring towards the fjord, but it means um, abundance or uh, it's a positive word. Doing some remodeling in hell. <laughs> Hell of a nice place we got here. Hell of a nice place. <laughs> this is hell. Free Guard Farm was part of this military base, sold it to the army years ago. Yeah, it's the, the Free Farm. This is why she's called Frigard, because uh, when they gave them names, uh, children were called, they had a given name, like Anna, then they had a second name, which used to be uh, the, so the son or the daughter of, and then the place where they came from, Frigard. We got some ancestors in yeah, there. That's her. That, down here. The church was built in 1130. Grave mound. Uh, it's, it's quite. It's a, it's a lot of people living in the center here who carries the name Frigor. So it's it's widely used uh, still. I kiss the church on that cross. by the river Need and you will also have a look at the cathedral of Trondheim that's the church with the uh, green spire the most important building in Norway it is the coronation kings of Norwegian kings and burial church uh, coronation church for uh, Norwegian kings and burial church for Norwegian kings how did it feel to be back in the land of your ancestors? It was wonderful. Yeah? It was fun to see where Anna lived. It would be nice to see the farm, but... JR, do you remember... NATO. Uh, yeah. Uh, the uh, church that she was probably baptized in. That was pretty cool. Did it feel like home? Nah, not really. But it was still neat to see. I wonder why she left. Not really, when you saw how tiny the farms were. <laughs> and eating porridge two meals a day, and that's all. Maybe we will eat breakfast. a little bit of meat. That would drive you to want to look for something better. That is Monk Island. Evidently there was a monastery on that island years ago. After they moved to the mainland, they turned it into a military prison. We just went through that. It's only 42 meters wide. And for me, too, because I really like mashed potatoes. We're having the sausage fest. They're just having a burger. So give me a bite of sandwich. We'll see how they sandwich pizzas next door. Celebrating crossing the Arctic Circle with a $10 glass of champagne. Going on the 
short 15 minute hike into Buddha. Inside the Bowdoin Kirk. had sheep and also goats. Uh, when you have sheep and goats then what do you get? You get wool, meat and milk. So in other words you get something to eat, something to drink and something to wear. That's also the most important that you need to survive. seems to be doing its work over here. Is that a little too much mead? Biden us. Ah, you're welcome. We'll come back again next year. Are you? All right, yeah, Good. sure. Yeah. You come to my in, house if you'd in, like. In, a, in, in a, the winter season or in the summer? Yeah, is it this nice in the winter? No. No. <laughs> it's cold. Located for about 80 inches. Fucking islands, and there is some cod. <laughs> What's the name of this town? What? Smaller. Smaller. Goodbye, Smaller. Hello, you hot tubbers. Cheers. School. Hello, hot tubbers. Hey. Here comes the old man with the view. Okay, this is the troll fjord. A skinny passageway for this big boat. Scott, the good example, is leading us to our hotel. We're out front, evidently. Here we are, north of the Arctic Circle on a beautiful day. In Tromso. <laughs> it's got like the whole logs in the back behind the glass. It is so awesome. Jerry's gonna put this in the man cave. <laughs> oh yeah, nice. Ten o'clock at night. It's like five o'clock. It never ends. Go. Yeah. 
Is this gonna be the best ride ever? It will be. All right. Hopefully. Sweet. Here we go. So Sam, you said you wanted to climb the That's our hotel right there. It's just a little after 12. We are down the hill. Yeah, that's so worth. In the 1980s, they got their parliament. We haven't even got a line in the water yet. <laughs> other guys are catching Can you bring fish. The other pole? I can't find the robot. Hello. 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 Babe. <laughs> All right, AJ. A sardine. <laughs> We've got some seaweed. Sam, way to go. You gotta catch a fish first. Yeah, you catch a fish and you can rest. Fish that Sam caught. As you can see first. Right. Let's try it. Tasty? Best fish I've had all day. The most fresh. <laughs> How is it? Courtney's enjoying her sister's fish. Courtney's driving the boat with her knee and one hand. Just like a driving car. Go with me. Oh, yeah. Can <laughs> we get out in the house? My feet were extremely sore. Yeah. <laughs> Traditional barbecue hut. <laughs> There's snow right over there. It's the Tromso Cathedral. I know a lot of you will be surprised by this, but we went on a cultural deal to the Mac Brewery, and we're now in their brew tasting area. Brew over 60 types of beer here. The furthest north brewery in the world. Not bad. It bodies up by five strokes. It's very welcome. What 
you have to say about that? Back from golfing in the sun, still shining in Tromso. It's about as dark as it gets. Iceland. Taking the long walk to the Blue Lagoon. Going west. Here we are at Thingvalum. <laughs> we are walking between the tectonic plates. One side is Europe, the other is North America. Scotty to the Lara. Lisa the Red. Spikey to P2. AJ just said he thought he froze his thing feller off. Here we are having lunch. Let's go! Unpredictable. Here we are at a crater left. Lisa is gonna get hammered by Thor. Wandering down the street in the rage of the midnight sun. The Hotel Obvinsk. On a 12 hour tour. These little houses were where the people lived 500 years, 600 years ago. Carly just walked in, even though you're not supposed to. Set, Jennifer. Willie Mammoths. Smile, This is the Black Sand Beach. Excess 
Scotty's got the high mark. We're on the hunt for the elusive pup. at the world famous something 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 hot dog stand all right who's the winners losers champions cheaters champions of the world Ha, 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 ha.